Talent and work ethic has always put Brody Harding ahead of the game when it comes to baseball. A year ago as a freshman, 14 years old, he was a varsity baseball player here at Moline High School, a rarity in the Western Big Six. Heading into this season, his college plans are already in place. He'll be a fighting Illini in a couple of years, and that talent and work ethic is in place as he reaches for even higher dreams. It was nice to get it out of the way, but I mean, at the end of the day, it's just another stepping stone. It's not my ultimate goal, so I mean, it was nice to get it out of the way, but there's other stuff that I'm have my eyes set on, so it was good, but at the same time, it's just a reason to work harder. Mm -hmm. What drew you to Illinois? What were some of the, the deciding factors? Um, when I was on campus there, it just felt like a place that I really would like, and the coaches there, I felt like I could build a really good relationship with them, and that was a big key in what I was deciding, and they felt like people that I could really make a relationship with. Harding's baseball background goes way back, as in back generations, and his family offers great support and know-how when it comes to the game. He's from a baseball family with Grandpa being a coach, and you know he's had some uncles and his, you know, dad and his mom were, were athletes in high school, and so I don't know if he had much of a choice, but he, uh, he certainly lives and breathes it. He, he, he's one of the hardest working kids that we've had, and you know he's uh, does a great job leading by example and on how he goes about, you know, getting his work in and. You know, when these guys are going home, he's going somewhere else to work out and trying to get better at his game. My dad's obviously the person who got me into it. He got a bat in my hand when I was probably one or two years old, swinging from that day. Um, he played in college and he had a good career. And then my grandpa, uh, he was he was been into baseball his whole life too. He still does some baseball stuff. And then uh, my uncle, he played in the minor leagues. I think he got to Double A, and then he he had a good career. He got drafted out of high school. And then my other uncle on my mom's side, he went to NC State. Uh, he had a long career too and I mean it's just always been there for me and I've always had people that I can look up to and people that I can do stuff with and I'm just living for right now I mean I'm looking forward to finishing out this season and seeing what we can do and then obviously the next two years they look pretty well too. Hey be sure to check out our website at IllawaFCA.org there's all kinds of great information about FCA including the many camps coming up and there is scholarship money available. With this FCA Story of the Week I'm Dan Pearson.